Well, I, I'm going to let me try to get as much as I can. Like that. So what is it? This is a cochlea. This is a cochlea. So this is a cross section of the cochlea. Can you guys see it? You guys understand what you're looking at? The best way to represent this is looking at And for all my students, I'm pretty sure I'm going to come around and show you the same thing. No. Right, so the cochlea is that snail-like structure, right? It's a long tube that spiral, spirals around, right? Okay, so what this section is, is they've taken essentially like this model. They've cut the, the cochlea in half like this, right? And they've opened it up. Okay. Now, for this slide, they're using essentially this. It's the same thing right here, right? This middle area, this dense pink area is what? This dense pink area right here is what structure? Come on. <laughs> oh, I went over this with my, my students. No, the slide. <laughs> if we went over this line, I went over it. So this dense pink area is going to lead to the vestibular cochlear nerve. That's, that's like the axons from your sensory receptor in the cochlea. All right, so you see all these, so you see all these like areas, these white areas around? Those are gonna be these chambers. So if we're looking at it like this, that's these chambers all around, right? And they come in triplicate because the tube is divided into three chambers, right? So that's what we're looking at. And there are, just like how this model is set up, there are many uh, areas of the tube that have been sectioned. So there are many triplicate chambered structures, right? And so there are many of these all along this nerve, right? So that is what you're looking at. And then we'll, we'll zoom in on kind of one triplicate and we'll go over all the parts, all right? <coughs> So we are looking at one part of the tube that's divided into three chambers. Can you? All right, so what you guys will need to know is the three chambers, the three membranes, um, the sensory receptors, where they're found, and things like that. Fluid in these different chambers. So what is this chamber up here? Scala vestibulum. This one right here. Scala media or the cochlear duct. And this one down here? Scala tympani. This membrane, this thin one right here, vestibular membrane. membrane. This one down here, basilar membrane. And this little kind of one with the hook on the end is what? Tectorial membrane. Too fast. Too fast? Okay. Scala vestibuli. Scala media. And scala tympan. thin one is the vestibular membrane. It borders the scala vestibuli. Right. So they sound the same, kind of. The one at the bottom, or the base kind of, is the basilar membrane. And then the one here in the middle, the short one, is the tectoral membrane. So, what are these chambers filled? What is this? What fluid fills this chamber? Perilymph. Peri what about this one? Yeah. Endolymph. Perilymph. Peri so the outer two are filled with perilymph. The middle one is filled with endolymph. Right. Uh, okay. So what cells are found like in this area right here? Hair cells and also supporting cells. You won't be able to differentiate between the two on the slide. On the models you can, 
So the model we have, a model that looks kind of just like this, you will be able to distinguish on the models because they have uh, stereocilia coming out, right? Cilia coming out, all right? Um, this entire structure right here, if I box up this all in, is called what? Organ of fourteen. What type of sensory receptors are, are if we are classifying based on the type of stimulus they recognize? What type of receptors are these? Piano receptors. Um, for, not for my students, but you may, I think for Jessica's, she may ask you to know what this area is. Here would be like the spiral ganglia. And then beyond that area on the model, when you guys look at the model, she'll probably want you to know the spiral lamina. That's the bony tissue around the, the nerve. My students, uh, you don't need to know that. Joseph, Athena, or is it Athena who wants you to know? Or Jessica, it's Jessica, right? Who was I talking to? Who's Jessica's huh? lab? I think she wants you to know it, yeah. For Athena and Joseph, I'm not sure. I don't think they want you to know it. Uh, I think that's it.